Hello? Mr. The One and Only Three Mac, man, baby boy, it's good to hear you, good to hear your voice, let these claps go through real quick. This Chicago, this nigga, 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 nigga. Hey, man, hey, I do apologize, right, I'm going through, I'm just going to tell, I'm going to give you a backdrop of, of what happened, right? You know, it's the, it's the new year, right? I'm excited. I got the interview done. You feel me? Now, now I'm putting it together. I'm finna edit it, right? So, I'm getting the music together. Boom. Granddaughter come through the door. She loved it. She loved the laptop, right? Bow. I walk away from the table. Bow. Granddaughter then got the laptop. Then took everything apart and put it on what she wanted to put on. And I didn't say the interview, right? Uh, <laughs> yeah. yeah, Joe, I said, oh, I got everybody, everybody was waiting on me to play it, right? And I'm look, I look up and I go for it and I say, damn, I forgot this little girl had my motherfucking laptop. And with the laptop that I, the new laptop I got, it's a Chromebook, right? So for some reason, if you, if you, Lock yourself out of it. If you lock yourself out of it, it erases everything and like it, it gives you like a brand new computer. And I'm like, oh shit. But hey, this how real it is though, right? You call back today and we usually don't talk, man. You just text. So hey, we're gonna do this for real, for real one more time. I need you to really let the people know where you at on your authorship and how you coming along with writing them books. Cause I know it's two of them. Give them the details on the books before you get off the phone. You want details? Uh, shit, details. Okay. One about my life. All right, let, let's start with the titles. Let's start with the titles. cut you off, but I'm thinking like but what like what you having time the time to sit down, right? To really cause it was unexpected, right? So by being unexpected and you having to face the time like damn I really gotta sit down and what I'm gonna do with myself so I don't go back as the same. You feel me? Like I cause cause I've been there, right? So I know when when it's time to really sit down, what was really the what was the thought or the, or the mistake you know you made that put you there that made you say, you know what, I got to fix this. So, what you saying, like, what was the catalyst for the book? No, like, like, um, like for the, the the reason that put you there in, in the fair joint right now. Like, you know when you was in the bullpen, what really hit you, like, damn, I got to change this shit. Okay. Because if I wouldn't have trusted this puss ass nigga, you know what I mean, I wouldn't have been in the jam I was in. You know, I mean, I gotta blame myself too. Right. Okay.
Right. There was a lot of times, man, things could happen to the nigga that didn't happen because of me. Right. So, you know, I, when I fuck with a nigga, I fuck with a nigga. So I had real love for him, like a brother. So the last thing I thought was that that nigga called 12 up on me. You know what I mean? Right. And, and, and that's what's real. So, but, but that being said, once I got, you know, I This Chicago, nigga! Right. This nigga, nigga! I to the joint. You know what I mean? Which was when? This was shit, 98. <laughs> so, I was, I started in Joliet, actually. Okay. Man, I got, Right, right, right. I'm like, I'm like, I'm like, here it is, right? Right. Years later, nigga still chasing his dream. It's never too late to 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 to, to make something happen. So I sat back and I said to myself, you know what I mean? I'm finna turn this negative situation into a positive. You know what I'm saying? I'm finna put myself in school right now. One hundred. Then. I think you was at diet. That's one of my my first cases, right? One Christmas, we all we all together. We got a bunch of steamers, right? <laughs> me, rest in rest in peace, Mike Mitchell. It was me, Mike Mitchell, and uh, rest in peace, Solo. We get popped behind my crib on cottage in a motherfucking Delta eighty eight or some shit. You feel me? We just all we just all out there doing us. One Christmas, right? And I wanna, yeah. I wanna mention about, of course, I wanna mention what fist sixty two hundred sixty one forty five Ingleside mean to you and the brotherhood that we got with the camaraderie we got with the brothers. Even though we don't always talk all the time, but we we a special breed. I want you to speak on that for the guys that's out here that's coming up in them areas that that feel sometimes they hopeless. But they can look at guys like us and be like, man, it's worth sticking it out. You feel me? Because you never know what tomorrow may bring. You feel me? Speak on that for me, bro. Well, first I'm going to just say this, man. You know, I love the tech. You know 100. What I, mean? I came to fish in seventh grade. I robbed the lunchroom and diet. Walt A's <laughs> March of seventh grade year. Yeah. I don't remember what year. I think I'm 42 now, so I don't remember what fucking year it was. Right, and I was right. I was in seventh grade, and I had a few more months to go, but all the time I was living 61, 30 hours the whole time, taking the train back and forth to school. Right. And uh, so, you know what I mean? They kicked me out. Long story short, you know, I, I got suspended. I had to come back with a pair of covers. My mama came back, you know what I mean? They like, man, shit, we don't want them back in the school. You know, robbed the whole lunch room. You know, right, them. right. You know what I mean? And the students ain't going to look at them the same. The teachers ain't going to look at them the same. It's just as best he move around. Right. So I slid. You know, I live right behind the school. So I transferred to Fitz. I come at that motherfucker feeling like uh, a foreigner, an outcast. <laughs> I instantly got in place. They can't, I can't stop. I felt like I walked straight to a brotherhood. One. You know what I mean? Right, right, right. And we, and we had all them, you know what I mean? The 
Shout out to the big homies. Shout out to the big bros. Yeah, shout out to them Fist Tech gangsters, right? You know, they 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 kind of set the pace, you know, to this day. We the only school that I consider like a school that turned into a movement. Who else called their school Fist Tech or or their school? You know, we we turned up. Like, Extreme Digital Triangulation. Yeah. We, tu- we turned that into that. Oh, shit. Hey, man. Hopefully he called back, man. But we're going to name this part. I'm going to get it to y'all right now, man. That was my man, 3 Mac officially live from the Fed joint, man. He did that for me. He talking about his book. He talking about his growth. He talking about his understanding. Hey, man, it's a real, real street nigga. Bring y'all, taking this time to bring y'all and educate y'all and motivate y'all, man. My man, 3 Mac. It's been part one, baby. We're going to give y'all some of this some of this heat, though. Hey, man, this is my man, Moo Boo Bubble Eyes with Big Dog, baby. Let's jump off into it. The Chicago nigga, yes, the Brazil, 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 Brazil. Niggas still broke, niggas still goofy. Same damn goofy. Basic bitch, I can bullshit, bitch. That's the same damn cool. Still getting to it, still with the shit. Back up on the shit. That big dog shit. I talk big dog shit. Niggas ain't with the big dog shit. I got a big dog wrist. Reach for my shit, bow, nigga. That's a big dog flick. These niggas fool, yeah, that's facts. I ain't for the cap. Don't think it's only rap. Couple bucks, get a goofy nigga whack. Back down, shit, bout damn time. Back to the grind. But for where you been, shoulda been cool and taking care of mine. Had to get back. Took some L's, come with that. Fake love, I ain't with that. So like hard and with it, had to step back. Hide in the bitch, smoking jet pack. Got my gold on and my jet black. He say it's I, better check that. Can't buy a batch of that wet pack. I grind harder than a wet back. No disrespect, but I get that. Hitting all lanes, can't leave shit. I need all stains. Can't trust a human, they all change. Bought a new toy, this bitch all playing with a beam on it. Put the beam on him, getting all brains. Turned his ass to a new strain. Only gas. I'm off propane, bitch, I'm high Five for the drip, little bitch, I'm fly Yo, bird like a new well, bitch, I'm wide Took his chain and that bitch gon' cry Touch my shit, that bitch gon' die No cap, I'ma rap all facts, no lie On some gang shit, still fuck that side Head cock to the right with the rakes in the sky Woo, I'm still flowing Go hard, bitch, I'm still knowing You wife turd, but she still going I keep it tucking, it's still showing Band increasing, it's still going Gotta stand on the check Never been a bitch, demand my respect Tell a fuck nigga, get right or get left Look, ball shit, This Chicago, nigga Sipping deuce like fuck y'all On my own too, no crush dog And I never gave no fucks dog When I lost short, I'm like fuck no Why the fuck they have to take big dog Back up in this bitch, back up in the same Same damn game Same damn name Chicago niggas still broke, niggas still goofies Same damn goofies Basic bitch, I can bougie bitch That's the same damn cool Still getting to it, still with the shit Back up on my shit That big dog I talk big dog shit Niggas ain't with the big dog shit I got a big dog wrist Reach for my shit Bow, nigga, that's a big dog flick This Chicago, nigga Yeah, we gonna do a big all 2021 Like I say, man, that was the official interview part one with three Mac to God, you feel me? FTG, GTG, MTG legend, you feel me? I-80, you feel me, representing for the Chicago land area, Woodlawn area, Fish Tech area, you feel me, Woodlawn area, you feel me? And I just wanted y'all to hear from G and, you know, because everybody got a outstanding love for G, you feel me, and since G been gone, everybody been supporting him, man, and, and really rocking with him, fucking with him, you feel me, I stand in constant contact with the man, he motivated to get out here and change lives, you feel me, he didn't went